So there's two kinds of lifestyles. One kind of lifestyle is horizontal. Most people tend to live a life that's, that just goes horizontal. So most people in the world, they live for worldly goals like success or money or fame or worldly happiness. 수평적이고 목표가 결국은 그렇게 살다가 아, 병들고 죽는 겁니다. So it's just a horizontal lifestyle and you you in the end you get your those goals and then you die. 근데 여러분이 추구한 삶은 그런 수평적인 삶이 아니라 이 수직적인 삶입니다. But the life that you're pursuing right now is not horizontal is a is not a horizontal life. It's a vertical life. 수직은 바로 so the vertical life is a life for the completion of the soul. So to complete your soul, first you have to find your in song, your human character. You have to discover your true value. And by doing that, you recover your insong, your humanity. And then from insong or human character, you keep, you develop and progress further into yongsong, which is spiritual character. So our consciousness keeps going up to And that's how our consciousness keeps going up to the next level. 그래서 인성에서 영성으로 영성에서 신성으로 가서 최종 영원의 완성을 이루는 삶을 사는 것이다. And so you live a life that takes you from 인성 which is human character to 영성 which is spiritual character spirituality to 신성 which is divine character or divinity and then you live a life that's for the completion of your soul. 그 목표를 가진 사람 People who have that goal. 이제 바로 영원의 완성을 위해서 사는 스피리처한 사람이다. Those are the spiritual people who live for the purpose of completing your soul. 영원의 완성을 위해서 살고자 하는 먼저 영원의 이름이 있어야 돼. So if you want to live a life of the soul, then first you have to have a name for your soul. 그래서 하루를 살면서 하루에 열번 이상 자기가 자기를 불러야 돼. So as you live each day, at least 10 times a day, you need to call your own name. 거울을 보고 Look in the mirror. 자기를 열 번을 부를 때한 번에 세 번씩 자기 이름을 불러줘라. So you look in the mirror 10 times and every time you look in the mirror to call yourself, you have to call your name three times. 그럴 때 정신이 퍼뜩 난다. And then that's, the, that's what makes you wake up and pay attention. 아, 나에게 영혼이 있는 거. And you realize, oh, I have a soul. That's, that's who I am. The physical body, in the end, it's going to change and it's going to get used up. But the thing that's eternal and lasts forever is the soul. So whether you're happy or feeling sad, no matter what the situation, I want you to always be conscious of your soul. And people who remember that, those are the people who are living a spiritual life. So how can I make my soul always shining like a bright star? Because our soul is like a star. It's like the star that shines forever. And that's who you really are. But you have to acknowledge and accept it for yourself. And that's what matters.